Hey guys, welcome to our channel. So we're taking a break from our regularly scheduled decode here. Um, I wanted to talk a little bit about these connections. Now, <laughs> when I say connections, um, a lot of people would associate that with the gematria because we connect them all through gematria, right? That can be done through the number 24 alone. Um, never mind the rest that interweave like we figured they would um, in connecting, uh, you know, whatever we find in the decode to the change itself and then to the rest of them. That's what, um, that's what we would normally think of. Whoops. Uh, connection, though means a relationship in which a person, thing, or idea is linked or associated with something else. Also a supplier of narcotics. <laughs> so, <laughs> but we're, uh, we're going to focus on definition one here. Um, so when you think of that, um, you could say that the fact that something changed and then another thing changed, that's a link right there. That's a connection. Uh, Mamwich, Manwich changed. And, uh, you know, Stouffer's, uh, the stovetop stuffing changed to craft, right? That was Moneybags' find, as I recall it. But you would normally, I mean, so there's a connection. They're, they're connected right there, and that's, you know, that's kind of a loose connection. You get into the gematria, that's a strong connection. But there's more. There really is. And I, I, I find it, uh, and by the way, I find it interesting uh, that I'll say right away that I noticed on one of Recall Vector's latest videos, he said that it should that the Mandela effect should be called the quantum uh, machine effect or the quantum device effect, or something to that of that nature. So there's a, a guy who's done his own research and came to the same conclusion as we've come to, and uh, so I find that interesting um, that he also believes that quantum machines are causing these effects. We only think they're causing some of the effects, but, but by some, there's like so many, um, you know, they've, who knows what percentage they're actually causing. But um, we think they're causing a fair number of them. I mean, um, so we have the, and I did not include in this list are new categories because they've only we've only ran them once but take the stock market various companies on the stock market <coughs> that you that we find in all these effects as soon as in, in forwards and backwards but i mean you know when you take the when you take the changes and break them down into what actually changed and you can run that through the stock market that's a connection right there never mind if they're the same uh companies on the stock market just the fact it'll go through that is a connection how about various financial institutions banks you know um market analytics um you know stuff like that retirement uh, finance places, you know, stuff like that. As soon as we can run through that, that's another connection. Um, and forget them being the same. Just the fact that, that we can find those things. Um, genetics, you know, forget, if you forget for a moment the connection of the protein coding genes that we find in so many of these effects, just the fact that we can take these changes and run them through genetics is another uh, connection right there. Same with medical. Medical institutions, uh, hospitals, clinics, you know, stuff like to that nature. Uh, the fact that they're all through these uh, effects is another connection. The fact we can find chemicals uh, chemical data sheets, uh, 
hazardous chemical data sheets, uh, chemical safety stuff, uh, chemicals in general, chemical companies. Um, the fact that that runs through all these changes is another connection. Um, in the numbers, atomic numbers, stuff on the periodic table, um, they're in every single one. There's another connection. Artificial intelligence, we found that a lot and started the category some time back. <clears throat> the fact that that's, that stuff is in there, that's another connection. Various laboratories. And, uh, you know, they're in every single one. That's another connection. Research, which we, we could take the groups out of that and just call it research. Uh, but various types of research, various research groups and stuff run through all these changes that we've decoded. Technology, various technologies. You can find it all in there, provable. You can't argue it. It's, it's in there if you take the changes. Um, and the translations that we've gotten. And I think we've gotten some translations, whether they whether we got enough information to uh, put anything cohesive together or not. The fact there are translations in every single one of them tells you that that's a connection right there. And then if you can convert that to numbers using the numerology chart and you can run back through the same thing, that's another connection in the stock market, another connection with the finance, another connection with the genetics and all this stuff. Um, you know, so that's a lot, a lot of connections. And I think probably the most frustrating part is we can show all these connections, we can prove what's in there, we can prove they connect, we can do the gematria and prove that they connect that way and still can't prove beyond a shadow of a doubt why. Why they connect, why this, and that's a strong connection. I know that uh, one of our viewers said it was a they were loose connections but uh, th that's pretty strong. That's pretty solid. Um, even if you, with all this and the gematria, I don't even have that up here, but let's say, you know, you decided, well, the stock market, you know, there's all sorts of stock symbols and, you know, even if you decided that you were going to rule the stock market out as a coincidence, then you have to rule the financial institutions out as a coincidence next. And then, if you manage to, to do that, you'd have to rule genetics out and medical and the chemical and the atomic numbers and the artificial intelligence and the laboratories and the research groups and the technology and the translations. And then you'd have to start over and do it all again with the numbers and the simple binary. And once we add alphabetic order, You'd have to start back over and rule all that out again <clears throat> with our alphabetic order numbers. Uh, you know, uh, that's pretty solid evidence and pretty solid. We've got some pretty solid evidence that quantum computers are causing some of these changes. Can't prove it. I can prove the rest of this stuff can't prove the quantum computer. I, I can show Gord, Jordy Rose literally saying that the quantum computers can dive into other worlds and pull back realities and pull back resources and create an effect in our world or reality. And I still can't prove that that's what's going on. I can prove that he said that can happen, that they can do that. <laughs> um but I still can't prove beyond a shadow of a doubt our theory. That gets frustrating. Um, and <laughs> I, I don't know how many of these we have to go through. Uh, but I'm going to go through as many as possible, I guess, um, and keep on going. But um, the fact of the matter is there's a lot of connections here. Uh, 
They would seem perfectly random. Stouffer's changed to craft. Stouffer's never had stovetop. It was always craft. Um, you know, take that and uh, the REM losing my religion said enough changed to set it up. Those don't seem to be, um, you know, those don't seem to be um, anything other than uh, two random changes, but they're not. Uh, the Led Zeppelin Stairway to Heaven, Gold to Stone, would seem like a random uh, thing to the others, but they're not. We can prove it. And uh, Losing My Religion was maybe it's Mandela's find. The Big Lebowski was mine. Sherwin Williams was Moneybags' is find. Dire Straits, Sultans of Swing was mine. Soft and Dry was Money Bags. Guns N' Roses Better was mine. Pinball Wizard was mine. Star Wars, I don't even know who first broke that. Um, Joan Jett and the Blackhearts, I love rock and roll. Money Bags. Mandela, fa or, uh, Mandela. Metallica Fade to Black was my find. Me and my fiancés. Ours, I guess. Um, Stovetop was Money Bags, as far as I know. Um, and there's our control group. Led Zeppelin's Stairway to Heaven was our find. Spin Doctor's Two Princes was ours, and Mamwich Manwich was ours. So <clears throat> the point is, these are different effects found by different people. None of them would seem to have anything to do with the other beyond the fact that it changed until you get into the actual changes and break that down and see what's there and what isn't there. And when you see that all the, I mean, it isn't the same stuff. It's the same types of stuff is there and stuff that we're not getting either. Um, tons of law stuff, you know, different laws, uh, tax exemption stuff, which is still law. Um, you know, we added robotics because of a viewer request, but robotics seems to be there. Um, we added machinery due to a viewer request, but the machinery seems to be there. Um, we added military because it's came up over and over, and it's definitely there. Now, will it go as a category um, through multiple effects? I'm not sure. Probably, because it seems to be there. Uh, much like everything else that's there. Um, so these aren't, uh, I hate to disagree, you know, but, you know, these aren't loose connections. Loose connection is the fact that it changed, so therefore it's connected to this other thing that changed because it changed too. That's a loose connection. Um, these are solid connections, and you could eliminate, uh, you could, you could, uh, you can't. But let's suppose for the sake of argument, of argument, you could say, like I said, that, you no, know, well, the stock market, we're going to, we're going to say that's a coincidence. Okay. Well, what about finance? What about the financial institutions? If they're a coincidence, what about the genetics? And what about the protein coding genes that are just littered through that? <clears throat> what about the chemicals? You know, what about the laboratories? What about the artificial intelligence? What about the translations? You know, <laughs> so, you know, the fact that that all that stuff is there, that's a lot of connection. That's not loose. That's a, that's such a strong connection that you could you could say we could eliminate the stock market from our search. And there's still a lot of connections. You know what I'm saying? We could eliminate, pick one, pick two, pick three. Um, we could eliminate several categories from our search. And by the way, it was Steve that, that pointed out that it was running in categories in the first place that got us to realize that if we ran this stuff through categories, we could get more information that way. And it evolved our process and it, it, it's there. He was right. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, so, uh, 
I don't know exactly where I want, where else I want to go with this video, so I'm probably going to end leave it at that. But there's a lot of connections, and uh, you know, <clears throat> they can't be disproven for sure. We can prove the connections, and and that's not just me. Um, I owe my fiance. Help me come up with this. We owe our viewers that chipped in and that, that pointed stuff out along the way. I never would have caught it all myself, probably. I know I wouldn't have. Um, so there's a lot of people, quite a few people that are, and some of them are gone or at least not commenting anymore or showing that they're around. But, you know, <coughs> it was a group effort. We'll put it that way. It was a group effort to get this far. So I guess there you go. The connections are there. They're solid. Um, you could eliminate them, some of them, and you'd still have to explain away the others. And the fact, and, and the fact that our conclusion is that some of these are being caused by quantum computers, the one we've decoded so far, we are very sure we're caused by quantum computers, yet we can't prove it. And another guy that I don't even think Recall Vector follows this channel. He's done his own research, and he he's come to the same conclusion. That seems to be, that seems like evidence. The fact that somebody else following a different, line of research drew the same conclusion that we did would be evidence for me that if you followed a different line of research, you could come to the same conclusion. So I guess I'm going to let this video go with that and uh, get throw that out there and we'll get on with Manwich Manwich here. Um, in the coming days. So for now, guys, thanks for all your thumbs up, thumbs down when appropriate. Thanks for all your comments, leads, feedback, and subscriptions. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. And for now, you guys have a great rest of your day.